Do you want Roblox to run super smooth with no lag and higher FPS? Well, I just found the secret void strap fast flag settings for 2025, and they really work. These settings can give you a huge FPS boost and even lower your ping. So in this video, I'll show you to feels your Roblox faster than ever. Let's get started. Gear Up Booster is a great tool that helps reduce your ping while playing games, and it works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it safely from the official website using the link in the description and enjoy with lower ping. Step 1. Maximize CPU performance by unlocking all processors for Roblox. In this step, we will make sure your computer is using all of its processor cores so that Roblox can run smoother and faster. Press the Windows key on your keyboard. Type system configuration in the search bar and open it. When the window opens, click the Boot tab at the top. Now click the Advanced Options button. A new box will appear. Tick the checkbox that says Number of Processors. From the drop-down menu, choose the highest number available. This number shows how many CPU cores your computer has. By doing this, you are telling Windows to use all of your CPU's power. This can make your system respond faster, run games more smoothly, and increase your FPS frames per second in Roblox. The reason this helps is because many systems only use part of the CPU by default, so unlocking all processors ensures Roblox can use maximum power without limits. Now click OK, then click Apply, and finally close the window. Your CPU is now unlocked to its full power, which means better gameplay, less lag, and lower input delay in Roblox. Step 2. Make Roblox use CPU. Better with Run with Affinity tool. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. In this step, we will make sure Roblox uses all of your CPU's power by setting it up with the Run with Affinity tool. Normally, Roblox may not always use every CPU thread, which means part of your processor power stays unused. First, open the Run with Affinity tool. Once it is open, go to the Affinity tab, then click on the three dots up a button to browse for a file. From there, locate and select Roblox Player Launcher.exe, which is usually found inside your app data local Roblox folder. After selecting the file, look for the section called Set Affinity. Here, you will see numbers representing your CPU threads. Choose the highest number available. This means Roblox will be able to use every CPU thread your system has. Now, in the shortcut name box, type something like High Performance Roblox so you can recognize it easily later. Under the Run option, choose Maximized, which will make Roblox start in full screen and give the best performance right away. Once everything is set, click Create Shortcut and this new shortcut will appear on your desktop. From now on, you should always launch Roblox using this shortcut because it ensures Roblox always has access to your CPU's full power. You can also choose Run Program inside the tool to instantly start Roblox with these settings. Doing this guarantees smoother gameplay, higher FPS, and fewer stutters even on low-end or budget PCs. Step 3. Newest void strap fast flags to optimize Roblox performance. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Now we will use another tool called void strap to help Roblox run even better. Go to the FPS boost pack and download the void strap launcher. After the download finishes, double click the file to install it and follow the instructions. Once void strap is installed, use the windows search bar again, type void strap and open the app. In the void strap window, click configure settings and scroll down to the engine fast flag settings section. Scroll all the way down until you see fast flags. Click the button that says, I know what I'm doing to continue. Then click the Add New button to add your custom performance settings. Open the text file from the Boost Pack. This file includes best void strap fast flags, which are great for most computers. If your PC is very low end, these settings are safe and reliable to use. These settings will increase FPS, stop stuttering, and make Roblox smoother. Copy all the text from that file and paste it into the fast flags section in void strap. Click OK to save it. If a message appears, click Yes to apply the settings. After saving, close Voidstrap and launch any Roblox game. You should see much better performance right away. In this step, I'm going to show you a helpful tool that can make your Roblox connection more stable. First, download the Gear Up Booster tool from its official website. I've added the official link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. The first thing you'll need to do is sign in with either your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can also browse through thousands of games available for optimization. To improve your network and FPS, go back to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Roblox, click the Boost button, and the tool will automatically start optimizing the game by finding the most suitable server for you. Next, 
Choose your server region. Always select the nearest server for the most stable connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best. Now, go to the End tab where you'll see a list of servers available in your region. You can either choose the nearest one manually or let GearUp automatically pick the best option. For the best results, I recommend keeping it on automatic. Finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster. Step 4. Use MSI Afterburner to improve GPU performance in Roblox. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. We will now boost your graphics card performance using MSI Afterburner. Install MSI Afterburner from your Tools folder. Open it, and you will see sliders for GPU settings. First, set power limit and temperature limit to their maximum values. Don't change the core voltage slider. Now, slowly increase the memory clock in steps of plus 20. For example, go from 0, 20, 40, and test Roblox each time to make sure it runs smoothly without crashing. Once you find the highest stable value, click Apply. This step makes your GPU work harder for Roblox, improving FPS and reducing lag. Step 5. Use the Optimizer tool to speed up Windows. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. The Optimizer tool is designed to turn off extra Windows features that use up your PC's power and slow things down. Open the Optimizer tool from your Boost Pack folder. Go to the General tab. Under System, turn on these options. Optimize Performance. Show all notification icons. Remove Menu. Delay. Optimize Network. Disable Error Reporting. Disable Compatibility. Assistant Disable Printer Services. Disable Sticky Keys and Smart Screen. In the App tab, turn on all available options to make apps work faster and more efficiently. In the Privacy tab, turn on everything to stop tracking and free up system resources. In the Disk Drive tab, turn off Superfetch. Hibernation. Now go to the tab that matches your Windows version, Windows 10 or 11. Under Gaming, turn on Game Mode and turn off Xbox Game Bar and Xbox Live Services. These features can slow down your PC while gaming. Under Privacy, disable. Telemetry Service. Cortana News and Interests Start Menu Ads. Edge Discover and Toolbar. In System, disable. People Sensors. Virtualization-Based Security. In the Windows Update section, you can turn off auto updates to prevent slowdowns while gaming. This is optional. When done, click Restart so all your changes take effect. This can make a big difference in Roblox and other games. Step 6. Disable useless startup apps for faster boot and gameplay. In this final step, we will make sure that useless startup apps don't slow down your computer. To do this, right-click your taskbar and select Task Manager. Once Task Manager is open, go to the Startup tab. Here you will see a full list of apps that automatically launch when your PC boots. Carefully go through this list and look for apps that you don't really need to start automatically. Right-click on each unnecessary app, like Spotify, Discord, or Adobe programs, and then click Disable. Be careful to only disable programs that you recognize and know are safe to stop. Never disable something you don't understand. Once you have disabled the unnecessary startup apps, restart your PC to apply the changes. From now on, your computer will boot up faster and run with fewer background tasks. This means Roblox will start quicker, load smoother, and perform better overall since more of your CPU power will be free for the game.